Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Had to do a video on this, I've just seen the pictures have gone live. JND Studios are doing a Batman, or THE Batman, uh, one third scale statue. And these are the different versions that you can get. These pictures are unbelievable. Uh, <laughs> look at this. This is nuts. Um, I don't know, I don't know what to say. It's obviously amazing. <laughs> I'm not getting it, I can't, I don't have anywhere to put that. I, yeah, but phew, Jesus, that is absolutely incredible. Look how real that looks. It looks like him. Like it doesn't look like a statue. It looks like the Batman from the movie standing there. As a lot of these things do these days in the collectibles world, we're in a very exciting time. I've been collecting since I can remember, um, and it's just getting better and better all the time. The cape looks really nice uh, it's great to see a really detailed look at the suit as well I mean with these pictures we can really scrutinize the details on this bat suit and for me it's kind of the first time seeing it this well lit you know I mean obviously in the movie it's it's lit the way it needs to be for the film you know dark and moody but it's nice to get a look at this this is the kind of thing if you had this someone comes around and they see the movie as well but at this point who hasn't uh, and they can just be like damn you <laughs> can walk up to this thing and just look at it for like half an hour. Um, there's the Bruce Wayne head sculpt. That looks incredibly lifelike. Get some close-up looks of that in a minute. I'm still looking at the suit. <laughs> at all the armor sections and, and just the details. Because I didn't look at these pictures much before I made this video now. I'll keep it fresh for the reaction. But I never noticed on the back there. What's he got there? Oh, is that the electric kind of taser thing that he jammed into that guy's neck at the beginning when he was fighting or was that something on his glove or gauntlet um, wow yeah that looks real it's ridiculous so I mean if I lived in a mansion and was swimming around in a swimming pool full of cash I would I'd get this <laughs> I'd get it but I am not so I shall enjoy it vicariously through the internet once uh, this thing gets released but just amazing. Looking at the belt now. They look like police, uh, where the ammo is, or whatever that is. That looks like police pouches on a police belt, like he's bashed this together from different things. They just look like uh, old police uh, ammo holsters. And just looking at the, the back. Never seen that before. So, he's just standing there, fists clenched and looking serious looking right at you that's what you want for Batman you don't really need him to be doing anything too uh, dramatic or dynamic move wise I'm happy with that I love his boots too now that just just looks so real the stubble and the, the leathery kind of texture on the uh, sewn together or stitched together cowl and the collar's really cool that's uh, grown on me pretty quickly when I saw the movie now this just looks like a real dude standing there, forget about it. I love the base as well, look at the beautiful brickwork. The clothing is just, that just looks exceptional. It's a gush fest folks, what can I say, I mean, I knew I had to do a video on this. I wanted to leave my last video up uh, a bit longer before I did anything else because I'm trying to sell two masks. <laughs> I've got two Halloween Kills masks folks. The last video that went up before this one, check them out, I've got one bloody and one regular for sale. But. Phew, I had to do a video on this straight away as soon as I saw the pictures released. I saw the teaser and I thought, okay, well, that's something to keep an eye on. But I didn't realize it'd be this good. I mean, it looks perfect to me. Is anyone going to complain about anything? I'd be curious. I mean, genuinely, is there anything not right about the bat suit? Or I doubt it. I mean, come on. It just looks amazing. So those are my thoughts. Like I said, why are we getting it? But I'll watch other people's reviews and enjoy those maybe uh, Forbidden Planet Up London will have one on display one day or something I'll get to see it in person I haven't been there in a long time but whew, look at it it's the skin it looks so real the eyes I mean if you really scrutinize the hair straight away that a bit of a giveaway I mean they've done their best and it looks fantastic but you can tell it's kind of punched in you know the way they do it but yeah, expression's pretty damn good too. Tie looks cool as, yeah, suit looks good, shirt looks good, fit looks good, the way it's sitting on the body. Really impressed. Man, 
I saw the film twice at the cinema, so go ahead and grab that when it comes out on Blu-ray. Get the Hot Toys figure, hopefully. But drop a like on this video, folks. Share it with your the Batman fans. Let them know this statue is coming. Looks incredible. Take it easy. See you soon. Bye-bye.